Hello there, everybody, and welcome to a new episode of the Bavaria game, for you 4 Cradle of Civilization. And we're waiting for aggressive expansion to die down before we take a look at killing Versberg. Cleese, Magdorg, and Saxony. Saxony's gonna be easy. Cleves is over here. Mouchdebech over here. It's rather piecemeal that alliance. Magdeburg is Saxony. Not all that much of an issue. And Cleves is it itself not very powerful. But, uh. Yeah, right, now we're dealing with rebels in Memmingen. Catholic zealots threatening to rise up in Memmingen. So hopefully we'll be able to end those as soon as possible. By force, if necessary. Come on. Spawn, damn it. Damn you, spawn already. I command you, as your duke. Duke, as your duke. I command you. Oh, we've discovered the Romash Gap. Oh god, oh god, Portugal. Uh, we could take the Diplo tech, or the Diplo uh, idea, cost reducing war exhaustion. That's 30%. It's not awesome. I prefer the, uh, the, the passive reduction, but that works too. And let's just go kill these guys in Memmingen. Or not, if you keep rolling like that. Sweet Christ, dude. Okay, that sucked. That was like seven or eight thousand casualties right there. Wow! Ouch. What's that? Let's say on the history. But, uh, look like Genoa. Which friends at war with has yellow. No, it's also. Duh. Alright, so Saxony's over, we've taken a 106 ducat loan, that's not awesome, but it's doable. Alright, let's take a look at these guys again. We can demand Diplo support, and admin support, I'm going to do that. Get another idea group. And I think we said we were going to do quantity for the manpower recovery speed. Yeah, we can still change until we take an idea of it. Yep, those were probably good. Those probably did something. <laughs> oh, uh, Bellum. I got a para. Oh god. Uturu para Belém and and Alcantara. Yep, got there eventually. Got there eventually. Okay. Oh, hey, Spain, Granada. Nice. Didn't make it. <laughs> uh, po oh, God, Poland. Why? Why do you tempt me? Temptress. Noble House of von Wittelsbach cedes to the throne. Die already, Poland. Brandenburg calls me to get Saxony, Cleves, Cologne, and Würzburg again. Okay, I actually want stuff this time. So can we can we do this? Yeah, put it on track. Did they? Dirt. Oh. They didn't come in, and I wanted them to come in this time. God damn it. I mean, hopefully, we still get mines out of this. I'll, I'll take mines. Don't get me wrong. I'll take mines. Haus von Gebstadt. Our air died, but we had. Ooh, oh, damn it, did we. 
Yep. We had that Dolair glitch. Damn it. I mean, Carl Theodore von Wilsbach is still pretty good. Don't get me wrong, he's pretty good. Just, damn it. The other one was so good. Brabulnach. I'll do that, but two means seven for that, and does he? He does have a siege. Alright. That way around, and head off to Petterborn. That's not nice. Why'd you have to do that now? So many of our cannons, why? Fuck it, everyone stay in there. If you're gonna be like that, then everyone gets to stay there. Fucking hell. Poland Gelray. Unalt. All very tempting. National manpower, we are still at 80. I'll take it. Eleve on mass. And we're ever so slightly closer to yearly prestige, which will help. Okay, we're getting there. We're getting there, we're making progress, it's all real nice. Just a bunch of friendly god... I was just saying it too. <laughs> Trying to be friendly here. God damn it. Let's climb on Nuremberg. I'm moderately okay with it. It isn't entrenched. Did anyone actually end up going Protestant other than us? Oh, no, Nuremberg did. Oh, yeah, that's gonna help spread. That's, that's real helpful, Nuremberg. I think I'll attack you next. I'm just gonna just take Nuremberg, Anal and Sa uh, Salzburg. That that'd be a good way to take Salzburg. Just take those two. If we don't get mines in this war, we'll just be incredibly aggressive. Because that'll shoot up two coalition levels again. But we, I mean, if the last coalition war was any you know, depiction of what a coalition looks like for us. I'd say we're in for good time if we have a coalition. France just gave us some money. Thanks, France. Yeah, you're a stand-up guy. And we've won Paderborn. Let's head there with the rest of the army to give... There you go. Now everyone head home. Now everyone's pissed. All of my factions are pissed. 
wonderful. The best kind. But uh, the best kind of faction is a pissed off faction. Did it. Now, I don't have a claim on mines. Yeah, it gave us mines. Okay, so scratch that problem. Mines is something we'll have to deal with for a while. But it's worth it. Until we pay off our uh, debt, I'm going to leave the maintenance slider dangerously at zero for the moment. Uh, Blasphemy Act, Strength, and... Yeah, sure. It's good enough. Why not? Where am I going? Where was I before? I don't know. I've lost track. There you go. I forgot where I was. Intelligible screeching. Alright. I'm not going to pretend I know how that works, but sure. Get us up as high as possible without going under, because we're at a very dangerous threshold at the moment. The, uh, the most amount of reinforcement we can give it without going red. And okay, that's right the inheritance. Surprised that uh, they inherited Naples before they did uh, for the Dragon, but alright. So we got the manpower one. Should we do production efficiency? It's pretty good. Uh, these two are pretty good as well. I mean, for us at this point, it's not an attrition one because attrition's killing us. But uh, we're doing okay for money most of the time. So I'm gonna go five percent morale of armies, or half of that in discipline. I'm leaning towards discipline. Let's go Holy Sacraments. Sure. Uh, where's the discipline? Whoa! Full okay! 27 favors with Brandenburg, and Bohemia is the Emperor. Well, shit. And Oldenburg is an Elector. Uh, so, Brandenburg, why did you forcibly make the Emperor stronger? Well, that's a turn for the worse. I mean, we have a strong Brandenburg now, so honestly, we could probably beat him with the help of Poland and France. Well, probably just Brandenburg and Poland and I could deal with Bohemia. But Bohemia brings in... Actually, not all that much. Bohemia's pretty weak right now. We could probably... Nope. Nope. Wait. Stop the plans. <laughs> Stop planning. It's, uh, it's not worth it. It's not worth it. Those guys are going down. Heidelberg. Right over there. Okay. Yep. Don't need any of the forts right now. Turn down and start to make some money. I think. Right? No, actually. Well, it's not imperative. 
that we have the army at full maintenance. Because even if we do, these guys are only 11 stacks. Denmark wants help against the Livonian Order, Poland, and Moldavia. Yeah, I'm not going to help you versus Poland. I'm not, I'm not going to do that. Why would I do that? Poland's my ally. Why are you even offering me that? How dare you, game. How dare you misinterpret my... my wanton conquesting for uh, betrayal. Yeah, Bavaria, I'm not gonna give you... give back the land. No. Leave. No one likes you. Well, apparently people liked you enough to invite you to be ever, but that's beside the point. Supposed to make me emperor, damn it. So I can kill people with no repercussions. <laughs> 50 diplo or grass expansion pack cost effect. Oh god, no. Ouch. Yeah, replace them. I don't care enough for that <laughs> to be worth it. Uh. Ability has something with an ability has expired. Probably the diet. No. Something. Nobility. Nobility's a thing. Probably. I think they're a thing. I'm pretty sure they exist. Is there even nobility? Who really knows? Uh, we can get. 14, 13, I'll take the 14, point 14 in Heidelberg, and Heinz is now cord. Very nice. Making more money. Real nice. Loving where this is going. Don't get me wrong, I'm happy I have mines. I'm also just really unhappy that Saxony is no longer the Emperor. And also they don't exist, but I mean, I, I could care less about the sovereignty of nations. <laughs> I'm more salty that now, in order to fight free cities, I gotta fight Bohemia. I mean, to be fair, I could just fight Bohemia. It's 42k. France... Poland and Brandenburg and I could beat that up. Bring in France. Oh, Brunswick and Salzburg. Yeah, bring in France to help mop things up. We can make short work of the Emperor. But I don't... I don't... I don't... <laughs> I don't... Can I avoid that, if at all possible, please? Not to mention, Provence is getting uppity. Austria still alive. Hungary. If we could kill Austria and, like, just take Linz, uh, Linz and Vienna, just take those two and then just turtle for, like, a hundred years while the AE settles down. <laughs> I'd be happy. I could, I could, I could be happy. Alright, diplomatic insult. Frankfurt, or every, yeah, let's have everyone like us more. No, the diplomat died. Oh, it's okay, there's another one. Lutpold Hafenbrodel. Hafenbrodel. Um, out of the air. It's Brödel. Lütpold Öffenbrödel. Bavarian Protestant. Welcome to the fold. Four point nine. Still four point nine. Good. Poland is still has no air. Die, damn it! I know you're thirty, but die. Oh, you're infertile. Oh yes. 
die and be replaced by a 60-year-old man so I can just inherit Poland already, damn it. Do it. Okay. We can get... Uh, the aggressive theory of opinion. I mean, Diplotech isn't great next time anyway, so I'll just take it. Give you the prestige and improve relations, which is so good. Because it helps uh, increase aggressive expansion decay rate. Oh fuck, we're dead! Uh, Karl Theodor von Wittelsbach and Denmark and Bohemia will fight it out if we die. Wonderful. Right now, though, we need to re up the alliance with po or the uh, royal marriage with Poland. I don't want a von Mecklenburg on the throne of Poland, please. Now let's also get one with Brennerberg and one with the Stuarts of France. The Scotsman on the throne of France. That's never not hilarious. And Ferrara is managing to beat Venice and... Venice, how did you manage this? How did you manage this? How did you do this? You let people on to Venice. It's not much. Oh, wait, you Florence is allied. Okay, good. Okay, it's your ally at least, okay. I thought that I was on the other side of the war. <laughs> I was about to get real sad. Anyway, end of the episode. I've been me. <laughs> You've been you. And I'll see you in the next episode. Bye.